Shake it. Shake it. Oh, we fast. Sun salutation A. I was like, oh, I'm done. Good morning. It's a beautiful morning here in Ubud, my second to last morning here. It is day 22 of the cleanse and day 11 of my juice cleanse. I'm now leaving for my soul practice. Good morning! I'm back from Mysore practice. It was good this morning, except I'm super, super tired. Time of the month arrived last night. That's kind of really hit me. I'm a lot more tired. Actually, I feel better now. This morning, even when I first started the practice, I was like doing sun salutation A. I was like, oh, I'm done. I did get through the practice. I'm not sure if I'm going to practice tomorrow. I was supposed to join some friends today for a five-day hike to the volcano. Not Mount Agung, but a different volcano. However, yes, I'm not going to do that because I'm too tired for that. Also, it is day 11 of the juice cleanse and I'm almost towards the end. And I'm really looking forward to it ending. This is the longest time I've been juice cleansing. I definitely feel the benefits. I do feel quite clear and I feel like I've released a lot of toxins. My mind feels good. After I finish this cleanse, I will do a follow-up video about my thoughts about the cleanse, things that I definitely had benefits from. It's still going really well. The sun is shining right now, so that's good. Just now going to do my coconut oil pulling. I'm going to sneeze. Hey! Hi, oh, yeah. The sun is shining. It's so beautiful. I'm just up here on the roof of my place and I thought I would drink my juice up here and just catch up on some work, check email and some personal admin and I have a juice here my first juice of the day this one is the vitality it's kale broccoli celery mint cucumber apple and lemon and the benefits are lowers blood pressure helps digestion hair eyes anti-aging anti-depression during my videos what I've noticed as I've been editing I haven't every day filmed every time I've been coconut oil pulling. I haven't every day filmed all the three juices that I've been having. I haven't done an enema every day. I know the protocol asks for that. I haven't done that. Shake it. Shake it. I try to vlog as much as I can throughout my days. Obviously some days I'm more social and doing activities than others. Maybe some days I've just woken up, gone to yoga and then gone to outpost to work. Basically I just wanted to, I wanted just to vlog as much as I can throughout these 30 days. That's just, just to note. Anywho, let's try this juice. absolutely delicious every time I drink a juice it's like so good one thing that I've really enjoyed during this cleanse has been really tasting the flavors of the juices I'm sure it will be the same as I start to eat again as of Monday starting to really taste the flavors of your food I remember last year when I became vegan I was raw vegan for five months I remember that I could really taste the flavors of the fruits and the vegetables. One thing that I really like with the juices because there's always different great fun combinations of ingredients and I love tasting each and every one of them. Yeah. Anyway, again, just to note. So good. So good. Go and get yourself now, after you finish watching this video, Go get a green juice. Green juice. Life. Life.
Just on my way out here, I'm going to meet my friend Olivier David at Alchemy. He was my teacher from last week. And then afterwards, I'm headed to Outpost. Oh, <laughs> there's my hand washing in the background. So it was really great. I went to Alchemy to meet Olivier David, who was my previous teacher. And we just sat and we talked about yoga and life. And he told me that he's going to set up a Mysore program in Kulam, in Queensland on the Sunshine Coast. So I said that by the end of the year, when I get back to Australia, I would come and visit with him and practice with him. So he's such a wonderful, amazing person. So you should definitely check him out on social media. I'll leave the links down below. I've just arrived here at Outpost. I met up with Olivier at Alchemy, such a cool place. Just had a coconut and we got to talk story. I'm looking forward to when I go back to Australia at the end of the year, probably sometime if he's not in Mysore, I'm gonna go up to the Sunshine Coast where he lives and go practice with him for a couple weeks or something. Great teacher. He may be having a retreat actually at the end of the year when I get back to Bali. I'm gonna do some work for about a couple hours and then I'm going to go to this Ayurveda talk by the doctor that I went to see a couple days ago. Got some juice here. <music> I just finished the Ayurvedic talk by Dr. Rimmel. It's really interesting. Of course, we can't learn everything in an hour and a half. Learning more about the doshas and, um, and all of that. Look, I will tell you, I'm a bit tired. Countdown is on. I've got three more days of this juice cleansing, guys. But I do feel good. Okay, guys, I'm back here at Outpost. I'm really hungry and I'm really tired. I'm not gonna last long here, I know. But I'm just gonna do a little bit of work and I'm gonna drink some juice and I'll probably order a coconut or two because I'm feeling hungry and tired. Oh, yeah. Excellent. Super excellent. I've left Outpost, I got a lot of work done. I've now come to this restaurant called Zest and I'm meeting up with a friend of mine who I worked with in the Maldives, so I'm so excited. Okay, so I'm very excited. I'm sitting here in Zest. Oh! with Bas, Bas from the Netherlands. So he and I worked together when we were in the Maldives. He was the tennis coach. He actually only worked there for three weeks, but- That's enough. That was enough, he says that was enough, I know, right? Um, he is living in Sydney, coaching tennis, and he's here in Bali just for, what, how long has it been? Almost two weeks, Almost 10 days. Two weeks. Almost, uh, 10 days, so. Yeah, we're just meeting up. We haven't seen each other since August last year, so super fun. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening. It's the end of another day. Day 22 of the cleanse and day 11 of the juice cleanse. It's actually really late. I was supposed to only work a little bit at Outpost and then come back to home here, have an early night and just rest. However, I ended up meeting up with my very good friend, Bas. He was the tennis coach at the resort that I worked at in the Maldives previously. He's been living in Sydney. He's on vacation now here in Bali. We got to meet up. Met him at this beautiful restaurant. We went to Zest. So it was great to catch up with him. I am leaving tomorrow from Ubud. It's been a really different time here in Ubud. I've loved the energy here. I've loved connecting with people here. However, the downfall is I have been very cold, as you know, and I don't do deal well very well with cold, and I have been juice cleansing, so I definitely feel that I've been challenged in a lot of ways. I feel good. 
Today as well was a bit of a rough day because I was super, super tired and didn't feel like doing anything. I still managed actually to do quite a lot. I met up with a friend. I went to, I went up with two friends and I went to an Ayurvedic talk and I worked as well. And I started off with Ashtanga practice in the morning. Definitely something that I'm learning along my journey here is that I do too many things. I am moving towards in the future, simplifying my life more. I'm happy, I feel good, almost through the juice cleanse. Been a really interesting experience. What more so has been interesting is connecting with people on such a different level than I usually would anywhere else that I've been. I really do enjoy the connections with people. I've met yogis, I've met just like-minded people with health. I've met digital nomads and entrepreneurs and all different kinds of people. It's been wonderful. Thank you so much for watching this video. I do hope that you've enjoyed yourself and you've had fun. Maybe you've learned something today. Please, if you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Please share it with your friends and family. And you can also follow me at Bottles of Om on Instagram. Good night, beautiful people, and I'll see you next video. Good night.